Do you sometimes run out of ideas of where to find a client or how to increase your sales? Today, I'm going to share with you 25 places or ways to find clients, increase your sales, and get more exposure. Building spirituality, family, health, and business. This is The Giant Builders with Lois Wyant. Good afternoon, Giant Builders. I'm so excited to be here and share with you. I have a list of 25 ideas that you could use to increase your sales, get more clients, and just build your business. Let's start with your current clients. Let them know about additional products that you have. Do some upsells. If they're already purchasing something, then chances are they like you, they love your products, and they would purchase more. Number two, look at your past clients. Reach out to people who bought in the past and you haven't heard from them in a little while. Maybe they just got busy, but they still love your product and they would be willing to buy more. Number three, of course, don't forget your family and friends and their referrals. Number four, your Facebook connections. All those people you're connecting with on Facebook and watching and and creating conversations with, those could be good customers, clients, or referrals. And if you'd like to have a little bit of an automated system, I will leave a link below. Number five, think about all the people that you send emails to. If you were to put a signature at the bottom of your emails with a link to your website, those could become potential clients or would want to learn more about your business. Number six, word of mouth referrals. Encourage people that have already purchased from you to refer other people to you. Number seven, what if you created a signature talk around one of your offers and offered that to local organizations? Chambers and other groups like that are constantly looking for good speakers. Number eight, take your signature talk and make it into a webinar. I have a great connection that I will put below. One of our guests on the Giant Builders and his specialty is helping people or businesses build webinars. What if you had a local business that was similar to yours or has a similar customer base and you could create a referral system with them? Research organizations that attract your ideal clients become members and participate in those organizations. Number 11, do an Instagram swap. Find somebody on Instagram who also has your ideal client and do a swap with them. write an article, or do a guest blog. There are so many forums and blogs out there that are looking for topics and guest speakers. So do a search for a blog for your topic and then offer them an article that they can post. Now that we're meeting more in person, you could actually get more leads by attending trade shows or conferences that attract your potential customer. Number 15, start a Facebook group and build your own community then people will invite other people to join the group and they get the value and you'll build up your potential customers. Be a podcast guest. It gives you the opportunity to share your expertise, but the goal would be to find a podcast that is already attracting your potential customer. I also have a link to a podcast group that I'll share below. Number 17, participate in Facebook groups that have similar interests to your potential customer in your product. Number 18, answer questions in social media platforms that show your expertise and share your product. Number 19, do a demo or offer your services at a brick and mortar location. Number 20, follow up with people who had said no before. Maybe that wasn't a good time for them or maybe they didn't understand your product. But a no at that time doesn't mean a no right now. Number 21, check your LinkedIn combinations and do searches for potential good relationships, customers, client base in LinkedIn. Number 22, create a meetup event. Number 23, join your local chamber. There are a lot of local people that are great business owners that would be good connections, good customers, and good referrals. Number 24, use cold emails. Make sure that you create an email sequence that is informative, sharing, and really good information that 
a potential customer would need. And number 25, there is a service called HARO that connects businesses and people with newspaper article writers. And they're always looking for tips and information and quotes. So if you subscribe to HARO, you can find connections. They will actually feature you in their newspaper articles. So those are 25 different areas that you could find referrals, customers, clients, just to help build your business. Thank you for your attention. If you have any other tips or questions, please list them below. Have a great day, Giant Builders. Thank you for listening. This has been The Giant Builders with Lois Wyant. 